everybody, it's Kelly Williams, and it's time for the Kelly Williams Show! Woo! 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 All right, so I'm so excited. As you can see, we are live right here at the gorgeous Walter Hall Park in League City because we are getting ready to talk about the League City Music Festival and Barbecue Cook-Off. Right, guys? Absolutely. Yes, I am right here with Holly, Hank, and Sean. Hey, Woo! guys. So, how long have y'all been working on the League City Music Festival, and what do you do? How, how long have you been working on it this year? Or no, overall? just overall. Okay. How many years have y'all been so doing this, things with the this music This is festival? the 67th annual what? music festival. Wow. Obviously, we have not been <laughs> doing the music for festival for that long, but yes. I did poll our committee last night, and there's several people on the committee that have been here more than 67 years so I'll, I'll, just, I'll just leave it at that so i've been doing uh the music festival since 2013. okay wow and i've been a lions club member since 2013. Wow. i started out actually uh working way over there in the parking lot way over there and i was yes. i was the young person and they said you can go sweat in the parking lot for 48 hours <laughs> exactly and by golly i did it and i was happy to do it that's right. Yes. That's working your way and up. And now I've hey. worked my way up. I have more responsibilities, more headaches, more yeah, stress. You yeah. know, and I'm so happy. Exactly. <laughs> and now you can sit in the shade on the Kelly Williams show and exactly, talk exactly. about it. <laughs> yeah. So, Holly, what, what have you been well, working on? Well, I've been on? on and off coming to the music festival for 20 years yeah. um, as, you know, a patron. And then I started volunteering in the um, beer booth. Uh, no, so I would volunteer, volunteer for the Lions as a part of another nonprofit, League City Proud. Yeah. Uh, would come and help out and sell beer to all the people out here. Then, um, as I became a Lion, and I've been a League City Lion for about two years now, I've been very involved with it, of course. Nice. She, she is one of our vice presidents for the coming year. So wow, congratulations. Holly does a lot of good work for the Lions Club. We're happy nice. to have her. Yes. yes, everybody knows Holly. Yes. Everybody knows Hank, everybody knows Sean. And I'm, I'm with three celebrities. And everyone so knows Kelly. Everybody yeah. knows everybody. Okay, Sean, how long have you been doing this stuff with the music festival? Since I was about 12. Yeah. Believe it or not. No, no kidding. Yeah. Wow. Oh, wow. No, I'm serious because we so used to go. Four we'd, years? We'd come from. <laughs> we, <laughs> We come from Clear Lake Shores and would ride our BMX bikes in the parade back when it was the Village Fair a long time yeah. ago. I remember when it was and we had fair. so much fun, like yeah. riding the bikes in the parade. Yeah. And then, uh, you know, then time flew by, and then uh, I got involved again about I guess 2006, started yeah. building a website and stuff for the Village Fair. Nice. And then more time flew by, and now here we are again, and now it's become a music festival, which is really cool. And they uh, given me the honor and the privilege and pleasure to be able to be a part of it. So I'm excited about yeah. it. He's, yeah. He's he's our MC, our co MC. He's one of our yeah, co-MCs. He's one of our co-MCs. You, uh, you are a co-MC. He, he's one of the, <laughs> yeah, like who's the other co-MC? We're going to talk about that later. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, it's a surprise. Awesome. Not really. <laughs> I'm excited. Okay, so I have a I question. I somebody so, famous. <laughs> yeah, I heard somebody uh, really uh, famous. I didn't. Well, okay, so I have a question. So when it was called the Village Fair... Um, did y'all have the village people perform? <laughs> uh, like I said, we haven't been here since the beginning. Sean, did we? <laughs> no comment. Not, okay. that, not that I'm aware of. Not that I'm aware of. Okay, darn it. I thought that would have been awesome. Okay. We've had a lot so. of other great, talented performers. You have. Yeah. This but not the village very, people. <laughs> this has become very popular. They'd have been fun, though, wouldn't yeah, they? Yeah. yeah, for sure. Okay, so this is the 67th year yes. for the Link City Music Festival. Yes. This is crazy. Yeah. I mean, if you have not been to it yet, what are you doing? Seriously, what are you doing? <laughs> you this is out. awesome. Um, I guess that the first thing people probably want to know is how many bands are playing because this is a big draw for the League City Music Festival and you'll always have really fun, different, great entertainers on Friday and Saturday. Right. Um, okay, so start start spilling. Yeah, so it's, it's this... <clears throat> coming weekend may 5th and 6th friday and saturday and i'm i'm very proud that our festival has music from open to close yeah so the gates open 4 p.m on friday music starts playing at 4 p.m on friday the the fair closes saturday at midnight we have music playing until saturday at midnight so sean's been working uh, on a lot of our staging and entertainment. So do you want to just run through the list real quick? And Yeah, I've got the list right here. All right. <laughs> list I've got just to make sure you I get You just happen everyone. to have it right there. Yep, yeah, thanks to Hank. Thanks, yeah. Hank. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> um, so anyway, um, Friday is going to start out at 4 p.m. with the Cheney Brothers. 
five thirty, and the, the you know the times are going to vary slightly based on different circumstances. But we're going to start with the Cheney Brothers. We're going to go to Wake Zone, then Lux Five, then Skyline. Then have you heard of Jake Bush? Yes. Rising, yeah. rising country music right. star. Yes. Unbelievable. The sound is absolutely fantastic. He's made a couple of billboards. I think that's five consecutive number ones. Yeah. That's pretty wow. cool. Yeah, so that's that's Friday. And that's a that's a packed afternoon into the evening. So fun. And then Saturday we have School of Rock, was they're gonna bring a lot of talented kids right. coming Yeah, right. So so yes. School of Rock it's actually School has Rock, yeah. they have yeah. young people, they also have adult bands. It's amateur musicians who are beginners and learning. Um, last year they played three hours at the festival and they were fantastic. Oh yeah, amazing! Yeah. They're incredible. Yeah, they really what bring a, it. You they know? do bring it, and what a great group of talented young musicians. Oh, they're amazing. They always bring it. Okay, so who's next? Okay, so next is going to be Scotty Fraser, and uh, what's really cool about him? A lot of things, but he's a veteran. Wow! So Love that's, that. he's really proud of that. And, and he makes original music, music about his experience as a veteran. Love um, that. So it's, it's a pretty unique experience. Yep. And then uh, Function, they're a great band. They play. They get funky, right? Yeah. Um, and then uh, so you got to come out and see some of these bands. They're just amazing. I put them all on the uh, on the Facebook and uh, and and I've gotten to watch their performances and it's just really cool to watch them. So fun. And then uh, Keegan Van. Keegan. I take a little pride in TV. Keegan. Yeah. yeah. Keegan, Keegan, Keegan Van. I know, I've, I know, I've heard the name. That is my son. That's your yes. son. He is going to be. He's awesome. He's going to be. The, let's just say the Holy Spirit's going to fill this park. I believe. I believe. Uh, where it's going to be a worship. Worship. Praise and worship. It's going to be praise and worship. It's going to be amazing. So if fun. you want to experience some amazing praise really? and worship, come out here and join. It's going to be a lot of fun. Great singer. Oh, plays amazing. the guitar. Plays amazing. the piano. He, he's Music. very talented. Amazing. And then there's this other amazing lady. Her name is Kelly Williams. <gasps> Kelly Williams. Hi, lady. Kelly's going to be Andrew. And Andrew Bay. Andrew. Andrew Bateman, Kelly, and Kelly Williams. Williams. Yes. Um, what do you tell us about what you're going to be singing? What oh my gosh, we're, we're going to be bringing a mix of stuff. We'll do some country, some 70s, some, you know, we just kind of. Uh, a variety. A vari we are a variety show. She brings it. That's it's right. going yes. to get exciting. We have fun. Okay, Sandy D. Sandy June. Sorry. Sandy, <laughs> Sandy D. <laughs> Sandy June. That's right, Sandy June. Sandy June. Sandy June. Yes. Excited. I've, she sounds fantastic. So you got to come out. Jonah Miles. Jonah Miles. And then Hamilton Loomis. Yeah. He's a local. Awesome. Born, born yes. on the island. Yes. Internationally touring artist. Wow. Uh, he has a mix of jazz and rock and soul. Kind of soul yeah. Yeah. So I'm very excited to see him and. Um, apparently, a lot of people are. We've had a great response to, oh, yeah. to that's exciting. Hamilton. Awesome. And then breakfast at Tiffany's. That's a that's a really good group. They're mix up variety. Yeah, really big band. So yeah. fun. Uh, they yeah. do a really great uh, um, version of a Journey. Oh. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. I mean, who doesn't love Journey, right? You got to come out and check it out. <laughs> so look, it's it. all at lcmusicfest.com. You can get all the times. You can see everything. Mm -hmm. Get all the information you need. If you have any other information, if you have any other questions. Mm -hmm. Share this video. Absolutely. Awesome. It's just, Share it. Is, is, I want to say it's a huge outdoor concert. Bring your lawn chairs. Bring yep. your blankets. Yeah. And we're going to have beautiful weather. And Absolutely. And listen, uh, I want you all to tell us. So if somebody has never been to the League City Music Festival and Barbecue Cook-Off, um, what can they expect? There's all kind of activities going on the whole weekend. So tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, it's, it's a big park. Yeah, uh, it is a very big but park. But when you come Pretty to the music perfect. festival, you're like, where did all the space go? So yeah. we cram a lot of activities into the space. Um, live music from open to close, food, all different types of food. Maybe Holly will tell us a, bit, a little bit about the food. But we have a kid zone for the kids to participate in. I don't think they discriminate if you're an adult. You I know? don't either. Yeah, I think you're allowed to bounce, you go in the bounce houses. and. Yeah. <laughs> and the uh, obstacle courses and the games. Uh, they're going to have a couple of surprise attractions out there. So uh, we'll have a kid zone. We'll have kayak rentals. Oh, and the cool nice. thing about the kayak kayaks is they have lights so you can cruise on the creek at night yeah. day or night Very we'll have cool. kayaks with cool. lights That's awesome um, beginners amateurs professionals you can come out here rent a kayak uh, we're right here on the creek it's a beautiful beautiful venue uh, we have axe throwing is back axe, yep. axe, axe masters, masters in league city <laughs> That's very cool. popular yeah, venue. Very cool. they'll be here with their portable exhibit yep and they'll have some competition for you um, so there's a whole lot of things going on we have vendors craft vendors. vendors yes we have the the lion train. Yeah. 
it's an outdoor vendor mall, you know, so you can come yeah. and buy crafts from locally sourced and locally made uh, <clears throat> artists. And can I interject for just yeah, a second? I would like to remind everybody, because you're going to thank me later, come out to the Music Fest. We have lots of vendors with lots of crafts, so you can buy your Mother's Day gift that's going to be the following mm, weekend. Yes! Very good. Thank you. Like thank that. you, Mom. And, yeah. and, <laughs> <wife, yes. laughs> and if you're hungry... What a good son. My wife and and if you're hungry while you're here, here babe. I love plenty you, of food. Plenty of food. Plenty of libations. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. We, oh, yeah. will, we will make sure you are hydrated. Yes. Um, Faust will make sure. Yeah, a lot, of, sure. a lot of the vendors, <laughs> this is important to note, a lot of the... Uh, vendors will take credit card, uh, but at the gate, uh, at the beer booth, it's going to be cash only. So um, bring your cash. We'll have some ATM machines out here, but I know a lot of folks like to just bring their cash to the festival. Um, so come prepared. Yeah. Bring your blankets, your chairs. Cheers. And it's free before five. Free before five p.m. And it's five dollars after five. And five dollars after five, which yesterday someone said five after five. That's practically free. So. And it's exactly. free before five, and then practically free after five. For an five, amazing five dollars. Yeah. Amazing, yeah. amazing music. Incredible! You can't go anywhere and hear all the music that you're going to get to hear at the Link City Music Festival. It is so much the fun. Squirrel. And he's uh, he's videoing the squirrel walk. Sean took his like phone out. Of I had to we take my phone out because I wanted. I was hoping to get that we had an audience member. It was a squirrel that yes. literally came up, and you could have just shown the picture of the squirrel. It would be kind of neat. I love it. Yeah. I, I love resist. it. I couldn't resist. Sorry. Okay, so people want to know about um, parking. Yes. Where, you know, where do you park? How is it set up? Is there handicap parking anywhere? Yeah. Easy in, uh, access for yeah. people? Easy yeah. in and out. It'll be the same as usual. So if you've been here before, you know uh, all traffic entering the park will be directed to the north entrance. Right. Uh, you'll come in, you'll be diverted either to the free parking, which is out in the big parking lot, which, you know, that's actually a very good spot to park. It's very close to the front gate. There's a handicap lot and there's also a VIP lot. Mm -hmm. The VIP mm -hmm. lot costs twenty dollars, and all that money goes towards the League City Citizens Police Academy Alumni <laughs> Association, who volunteers with our PD. And I think they're yeah. actually raising money right now for the Blue Santa program. So I love it. So all the money generated that. at the event mm -hmm. is going towards local charities. And we are going to talk about charities right now because if you want to know. Where the money goes that you spend right here at the League City Music Festival, it goes to several different really great charities that the Lions Club support. So right. somebody tell us what charities y'all support. Yes, so well, there's we, we a whole support, host. The Texas Lions Club camp is, is a big one. And then we do yes. Kids First that Division. And I think, how yeah. many glasses did we get last year? Last year, year we collected mm -hmm. over 3,000 pairs of old eyeglasses that were yes. recycled and repurposed for people in need. Um, Holly mentioned the Texas Lions Camp, which is a camp in Kerrville, Texas. There's yeah. eight camps every summer for kids with different uh, challenges or disabilities. Um, they do two camps for kids with, uh, I think it's type 1 diabetes. diabetes. <laughs> and what I've heard is for a lot of these kids, after their diagnosis, this is the first time they get away from their parents. Absolutely. And the first time they're able to have some independence. And then on the flip side, it's the first time the parents have had you know, an extended okay. period of time where they've had a break, because really nice, um, yeah. you know when you have a kid that's type one diabetic, yeah. it's very challenging. You yeah. got to monitor their levels, and and um, so it's a whole learning process. But that camp is just very important. We contribute funds to it. We contribute time mm -hmm. and energy mm -hmm. to it. Uh, locally, we do a lot of disaster recovery uh, type work whenever the moment strikes. So Deer Park, Pasadena got hit with a tornado recently. We were able to um, go and take them some goods and and do some relief efforts. Uh, a couple years ago when Louisiana got hit by hurricane, we sent yeah. trailers and trailers full of goods out to Louisiana. Uh, we brought back our scholarship program. I could talk about yeah. our charities yeah. all day, but we brought back yeah. our scholarship program. Uh, so this year we gave three $1,000 scholarships to graduating high school seniors. We had 43 people from League City High Schools apply for the scholarship. Amazing. So next year our goal is to give more. more. So exactly. Um, we want to do more than three. We might want to even increase the the award amount. Um, so hunger, vision, Texas Lions camp, scholarships, senior first responders breakfast. Yeah, every month, Sunday, first Sunday of the month, seven. 30 a.m. at Hometown Heroes Park. Take we do care a breakfast. Five families every week. I love it. Yeah. So, so the Lions Club is is an amazing organization. Yes. If somebody is watching the show and they say, "I want to be a part of that," right. how do they join the Lions Club? Well, I'm going to make it easy. Yeah. You okay. can go to our Facebook page, and Holly, Holly, or I will respond to it. But 
you can call me on my cell phone, 281-768-0145. Again, call me on my cell phone if you have a question about the call festival <laughs> or about joining right. the Lions Club, 281-768-0145. I think that's the easiest way. Okay, um, so and you'll you answer. Call me directly, hey, I'll answer. answer. So Yeah. yeah. There you go. Call or text. Call, call or text. Or text. <laughs> and I say, I tell people, call, you know, 24-7, any time of day. Yeah. Just if I'm sleeping, I won't answer. I'll, I'll call you back when I yeah. have some time. Oh, that's nice yeah. to know. Absolutely. <laughs> um, okay, so what do you each think has been your favorite part about being part of this League City Music Festival every year? Well, first thing, I love to eat the food. Yes. yes. something we need to uh, talk about for sure is all the amazing food that's going to be out here because yeah. it's just there's so many talents out here when it comes to uh the food they're just they're just awesome I mean, you've got barbecue what, what kind of food do we have well we have your, your, your tradition but we're having crawfish and barbecue and it's sausage crawfish? on a stick and all yum oh yeah. my god yeah there'll be rum cakes yum. and cheese cakes cheese cakes <laughs> Cotton candy. We have some Mexican candy. I mean, there's a whole I mean, host of food products that'll be out here. Yeah. All right. So <laughs> your favorite part is the food. Yes, because I work up in Appetite while I'm uh, out here. Absolutely. So yeah, I definitely, you know, I've got to eat. It is delicious food. Yes, it it's is delicious. amazing. Yeah. Hey, sure. what is your favorite part about working on the League City Music Festival? Yeah, well, two, right? So my first favorite is watching Kelly Williams and Andrew Bateman on stage oh, live. You. In person, mm -hmm. yes, um, it's a real too. treat. That's your favorite. <laughs> yeah. We'll find a new one. I said I, it. I am. And then my, you know, my second most favorite thing really is just seeing so many different people come throughout the yeah. park. So like, there's that there's people too. that we know. There's a lot of people that we yeah, know. Yeah, get to see. But. but then there's also so many people from around the area, the region. Um, I mean, we have people come from outside of the Houston area to attend the music festival. Yes. Um, it's just a good time, and so yeah. getting to meet different people. Usually I'm running around like a chicken with my head cut off, so if I don't have a whole lot of time to talk, then you know, forgive me. But he's I not love, ignoring you. Yeah, I love he's the people. Busy. I love seeing everyone, all of our friends. <laughs> yeah, you know, exactly. So. Everybody having a good time. Yeah. Exactly. And the bands are always such a treat. He took all, he took my answer. I'm sorry. But yeah. no, but I love working on this whole festival. I mean, working with the amazing people we get to work with, with the Lions Club, all of our members are just incredible. And it feels so good when sponsors step up and want to give you money to contribute to something you're working on. Because the more money we make, as this is our largest fundraiser, the more time we have to serve doing what's in our heart, what we really want to do. Mm -hmm. So we sp is, we'd much rather spend our time serving than trying to raise money. Absolutely. So um, it's, it's an awesome event and with a whole bunch of awesome yeah. people so that's amazing yeah. so okay. we are still Go taking ahead. sponsorships well know? that's what i was going to ask you if, so how if you can call my phone number sponsor... you can message us on yeah. facebook you can look us up on our great website lcmusicfest.com com, yeah. and let me you said the festival you like meeting all the yeah. people seeing the people kids day friday yeah, yeah. so friday we're bringing yeah. back our kids day which is a day for uh, some of our special education classes and CCISD and DISD mm -hmm. to come and be at the park. So we're going to have about 500 students and teachers at the park on Friday morning. It's wonderful. Um, enjoying mm -hmm. the kids zone yeah. free free of cost. So while we're setting up the rest of the fair, they'll be here. You know, COVID stopped that for a few years, um, but we're able to bring it back this year. And I know that's something that's real special oh, yeah. to Holly. Oh, yeah. um, and then. Sean is a man of many connections, many talents. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, he was able to connect us with Bay Area Christian School, uh -huh. and they're going to have their yes. their students come out and volunteer <laughs> during it. Kids Day. That's so they're going to work. With, nice. They're going to work with the students and yeah. kids working with kids. So yeah. Absolutely. But speaking of volunteers, if anybody's interested in volunteering, we can always use volunteers. So again, call Hank. <laughs> <laughs> Or contact us through our social media. We'd love to sign you up. Seriously, if, nice. you, can, if you can get involved in this, it's so rewarding. It I mean, really I make the joke about is. the food. Of course, I love to eat. That's obvious. But the thing is, is uh, you know, for me, the MC portion of it is a lot of fun because you get to interact with everybody. You interact with the yeah. bands. You interact with the crowd. You interact with the leaders of the organization. It's a lot of fun to get the energy going. And Kelly... I, I can't know, wait. I know she you understand this because that's why she's co host She's co hosting. Yay! She's the co MC. Yeah, You're the co MC. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes. I'm so excited. Yes. <laughs> I am so excited to be co MCing with Sean this year for the uh, music festival. <laughs> Cannot wait. It's gonna so, be so much fun. fun. We're going to have we're a gonna, blast. We're so, gonna bring you guys, it all need to come, come party with us. Y'all are going to be on stage? 
Yes. Are y'all gonna have microphones? Yes. yes. Who, they made, who, who made that decision? Right? <laughs> they, were brave, they were brave enough. They were brave enough to to give me a microphone. That yeah. was yeah. That's it was, it was cool. all approved. I trust Kelly a little bit more than. No. <laughs> I'm pretty excited about it, you know, because another thing, uh, um, the, the group, Terry Vaughn RV, actually donated an RV for us to be what? able to have, yes. Backstage for the bands. Oh, for the, my gosh. For backstage for us to be able to have some AC relief because also, keep in mind, you want to stay hydrated, but one thing from last year, we noticed it was, it gets hot, right? Mm. So yes. <laughs> when you're out there working, it's nice to be able to take a break in the AC, get hydrated, and uh, they really stepped up to the plate with that. I was very Thank thankful you. That, that yes. is awesome. That was awesome. Wow. Okay, so I want one word from y'all to describe the festival to somebody who's never been here one word I'm that not, describes the league city music festival <laughs> unforgettable Ooh. Yeah, that's nice yeah. it's unforgettable i mean you're gonna at some point no matter mm -hmm. what in the festival there's gonna be something out there that's gonna stick out to you and it's gonna be unforgettable and it's, yeah. it's gonna make a mark and, it, and and even more than that it's not so much it, it is unforgettable for those who get to come and experience it but it's even more unforgettable for those who get to benefit from it the kids and everybody right. they're never gonna forget where it comes from right. that's you know? right so unforgettable <clears throat> unforgettable i'm gonna go with americana americana, yes. americana. Don't bring it. yes and it's just a big community party. People it are coming together amazing. for a cause, enjoying, you know, music and food. Um, and when I think of, you know, America, I think of events where people are together and are happy and are celebrating. So the small yeah. town, these smaller town events that yeah. you you cannot get this feel anywhere else. Yeah, I know. It's really Lake community. City brings it. Yes, but it, it, everybody from all over the county will be here, and that's what's really nice. And Absolutely, it's local, and we're really supporting. I love that we're back to local talent. I, I mean, we have so much amazing local talent here. It's incredible. And if you have if you haven't been or you haven't seen any of the local talent, come out. You will be amazed by the talent. Yeah. Holly, what is your one word? What do you think? Oh, I guess I'd just say it's remarkable. Remarkable. Love it. I mean, it really Three is. very good words to and, describe um, it. Some of the best memories that yeah. you can make, you'll make out here during yeah. a festival. It's, yeah, it's a, <laughs> Kelly, it is a lot of work. And <laughs> a lot of, and a lot of members, they will spend, I said 48 hours earlier. That's not an exaggeration. I mean, there's members who will spend multiple days all day even sometimes staying the night out here to make the festival happen yeah. and we wouldn't do it if we didn't love it Absolutely. so i, I want to thank all the people who are making it happen all the people who are going to be at the end of it going a little bit crazy um do we sleep for a few days afterwards <laughs> yeah. or we clean up and then we sleep for a few 10. days afterwards yeah, yeah but yeah. So it's it's a big endeavor, but we do it because you know we love oh, it. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, okay. So guys, when is the event? May fifth and sixth, Friday and Saturday. Friday and Saturday. Music starts at four o'clock. Four on p.m. Friday. on Friday. Four p.m. on Friday. Ten a.m. on Saturday. There you go. All the way till midnight both nights. Yep. And can I give a shout out to a few of our special sponsors? Please do. Yes. So we have so many sponsors. I can't. I can't name all of them. Yeah. I thank all of them. Uh, Kaler Energy is a big time sponsor again for us again this nice. year. Thank Ron you, Ron Carter. Uh, Faust Distributing is going to be participating again as our uh, beverage supplier. Awesome. Uh, Jimmy Fallen for Sheriff will be serving uh, in the beer booth as well as some of our Lions Club members. Right. Uh, Commissioner Apfel has uh, been a sponsor. Ellie Mental Health and yep. Franchising Smarter has uh, sponsored the building on site. Awesome. And for the building this year, we're actually going to have our, bob our barbecue competition championship opening and closing ceremonies and our judging all take place in the air conditioned building because of elemental health and franchising smarter wow. uh sign shop nice. hometown bank i mean there's so many different people who have pitched in and, and really made this event possible yeah isn't that wonderful so, the city, the city of lake so city <coughs> galveston I mean, county yeah, this is what it's about right. right here that's amazing thank you to all of our sponsors all the volunteers thank y'all for everything that y'all are doing to make this a huge success again Thank and you. help so many charities and people um, in need that um, we're all able to help because of all of your hard work. We really, really appreciate it. Um, tell people it's at Walter Hall mm -hmm. Park in Link City. Mm -hmm. Does anybody know the address? 
807 South Highway, South Highway 3, Three. Lake City. <laughs> there you go. Okay, guys. I mean, you can put it in the map so, Walter Hall Park. Come on, it's, yes. come up. It's, yeah. it's a big place. So if you're Siri. coming from out of town. I think it's 807. <laughs> it is. It is. <laughs> but it would be funny. If we were wrong and everyone showed up at no, wrong, CVS or, or showed up at uh, Esteban's or at El Centen, you know, maybe we just exactly. gave someone a lot of business. They showed up at yeah. Red River. Red River, yeah. yeah. Red River, Red River is sponsoring it again. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Red, 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 Red River, yeah, they're going to yeah. yeah. feed River. the volunteers. That's so. hilarious. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching today. I, it has been an honor and a pleasure to be with these three amazing people. Holly, Hank, and Sean. Come the out. League City Music Festival and Barbecue Cook-Off is us. coming up. Yeah, we we yes, want we you to be here. So we will see you May 5th and 6th right here at Walter Hall Park. Say that three times fast. Walter, Walter Hall, Hall Park. Park. Walter, Walter Hall Park. Park. Walter Hall Park. Hey, very good. All right. Kelly <laughs> Williams. <laughs> Kelly <laughs> Williams. <laughs> Kelly Williams. <laughs> I have my own cheer. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching. We Thank have you. an awesome and blessed rest of your day, and we will see you right here at the League City Music Festival, May 5th and 6th. Bye. Bye. Bye.